You might have fuck up that ball that time. No sick code, go, no sick code. I need to get your pussy right back, man. Fuck that. I don't give a fuck that. What is that? What the fuck? Well, that's still got barrack shit. Oh, yeah, good news, Russian. There you are. I've been looking all over for you. You're just in time. We almost had to start without you. We couldn't have that, could we? Look who showed up, everybody. Deal him in, would you, Ruffles? I do hope I recall the rules. It's been ages since I've played a game of Wicked Grace. Grab a seat. We're ready to start. Are we playing cards or what? Are three drake better than a pair of swords? Ugh, I can never remember. Seeker, remember how I said, don't show anyone your hand? That rule includes announcing it to the table. There's a crown on his head, but a sword too. His head didn't want either. Don't talk to the face cards, kid. You seem to have enough people. I have a thousand things to do. Losing money can be both relaxing and hard for me. Give it a try. Curly, if any man in history ever needed a hobby, it's you. Dealer starts. Oh, I believe I'll start at. Oh, three coppers. This said three coppers. You ain't sure this. Daring. Maybe I'll make it one. No. Boldness. Three it is. Seriously, who starts at three coppers? Silver or go home. Sounds good. I'm in. Bolder the better, right? I'm in. Me too. Well, are you in? I'm in. And raising another silver. You haven't even looked at your cards. Well, our illustrious leader is betting we're bluffing. You are bluffing. <laughs> the poor recruit ran out into the dining hall in nothing but his knickers. And this profound silence fell over the hall as 70 mages and 30 Templars all turned to stare at once. Then a slow round of applause began and spread until every soul was on their feet. A standing ovation. <laughs> What did he do? Saluted, turned on his heel, and marched out like he was in full armor. <laughs> he did not. Good man. <laughs> You're shitting us. <laughs> That's how you know it's true. I could never put that in a book. Too unlikely. I've got one for you. So, my kit was hired for a simple caravan escort in southern Navarra. Twelve days of walking alongside donkeys and men who smelled like donkeys across fat nothingness. Chokrakar turned to the donkey and said, We'll let this go if you will, and walked away. <laughs> my bad. You don't mind if I steal that one, do you? <laughs> well done. <laughs> you ought to tell stories more often. I like the part with the rabbit. There should be more rabbits in stories. <laughs> that was scandalous. It would ruin the Inquisition if anyone found out. Tell it again. And the dealer takes everything. I win again. Oh, fuck again. It. I figured out your tells, Lady Ambassador. Commander. Everyone knows a lady has no tells. Then let's see if your good fortune lasts one more hand. I want another chance to win my dignity back. Deal me in. <laughs> Damn, I'm fucked. Don't <laughs> your word. Damn, son. <laughs> I tried to warn you, Curly. Never bet against an Antifa, Commander. I'm leaving. I don't want to witness our Commander's walk of shame back to the barracks. No, they're in. It comes off. Have you ever um had the game with everybody playing um what Wicked Spices or something like that, Wicked Games, or whatever? 
and fucking Colleen got like when everybody went together and it was drinking, it was just playing a game of cards. Have you ever had the shit when everybody was playing a game of cards? It's too easy to mistake you for the Inquisitor. Dragon Age. I enjoyed this. See? That's what I mean. It's easy to Like I'm talking about the um the cutscene. Like those statues of Andraste holding bowls of fire. At, at least it is for me. You up yeah, you have to do fucking um words, um very shit to do it. I wouldn't miss it. Could. It'll take me a while to talk Cullen into it. Maybe I'll work the revenge angle. Is that? Did I win? Damn, Sarah was not even gay. She was seeing some shit. Mom said, come on. Damn, that nigga fucking. Something you wanted to talk about? Tell me more about Bianca. Not making any promises here. Ask. What makes the Merchant's Guild such a danger to her? Well, to be fair, it's more of a danger to me. Technically, we're not supposed to be within 300 leagues of one another. If it got back to the Guild that we were seen together, they'd freeze my assets and then have me killed. Maybe not in that order. What in the world did you do to cause that? We almost started a clan war. Does it matter? I, I can't change it now. I guess that's it for now. Move like a fucking fuck that right now. Huh? It's a plant shit. I feel like it's a plant shit. A good place to pick yourself. What do you need, my friend? I have some more questions. As you wish. Why? You don't seem to like your homeland much. My family polluted it. Are you sure it's not? I, I doubt it. She had no bump. I know what you're talking about. My uncle treated me like a porcelain doll to be placed on a shelf and dusted on No, like she was like. Thus, I did you do know, like, people do try to own their own, like, fucking nieces and nephews, right? By then, I realized I knew it not at all. Even if she did, I don't give a fuck, so. <laughs> but I. Badass, man, okay. It ain't mine, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, it can't possibly be mine, something. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba Yeah. Your uncle? What about your parents? They had the misfortune of taking the wrong side in the second attempt to overthrow King Marcus. Well, I'm told they said King Marcus over. Oh shit, my brother and I since we were family and children at the time. Thus, we were raised by my uncle, a mortal Etasi who preferred the company of his corpses to the living. Oh, shit. Your uncle was a fucking, um, what was it? Um, yeah. Necromancy. The door in his right now. What I am, my other fucking shit. The supervised the crypts, like priests. Uncle Vestalet oversees the Grand Necropolis. This is when Tristan looks looks at the fucking friends list. It is odd to be so fascinated with death and its yeah. trappings. I will never understand it. I would check, but I'm streaming, so I don't want to have that full buffer. So you were the right hand to the divine. To divine Jones. Tristan, is he telling the truth? And divine Beatrix before her, in fact. Mm. The position is normally reserved for Templars of the Knights Divine. But my circumstances were unusual. Unusual how? If that's you what if that what makes your boat son and makes you good for the night, I, I think there's something wrong with you. But it isn't as exciting as some drum it up to be. 
The short version is that I once saved the previous divine. This should be with you. My reward was becoming her right hand. But what does a right hand do exactly? So he has to go to all three. Actually, no, nah, I had like three fucking things since I played with Tristan. <laughs> and you know, I don't do fucking little big planets, so I just stole some costumes I was wearing. So that would get you, get you wet at night? I'm too hungry to get fucked. No, nigga. No, nigga. No, nigga. No, nigga. So you can still do it. I should just bring my fucking controller with me. <laughs> Justinian knew the war was coming long before it began. She tried to avert it. Right, I kind of hate when games like force feed you a fucking like tutorial. I'm like, hey, I actually like when they ask you, do you want to go through this fucking shit? It's like, yeah, thank you for asking me. I don't. A means to preserve as well as an agent for change. I only wish she had lived to see it. So what's the story about you becoming the right hand? Sweet Andras. Little Red Rider. You just a, you're just a fucking Red Hood in those. Years like, ago, some still discuss it. It is, nigga. The fuck? You act like I'm lying. Do you want to fight? I barely recognize you. You want to fight, bitch? Now. I find you. No, I'm not downloading that shit again. <laughs> I need a space, you bitch. So yeah, I did do this. 